What is that? A trash can robot? Five A. XLG source. No attack capabilities. Whatever. I hope they don't endlessly spawn guys. I, that would not be fun. <laughs> Rocker, 80s video games want their mapping software back. Hey, Killeek, you know, they, they the human race has been underground for a, a while, so they that they started over. Although when they went underground, all they had was a copy of Adventure and like Mini Golf for the 2600. What is this? Oh, it's an, an, another TV room. Okay, let's go take a let's go, let's go watch what's on the two. New roll. The Earth's last remaining outpost of civilization and a utopia built by the great Michael Byfloss, fifth chairman of the Byfloss group. The city is completely automated. Here at last, mankind enjoys an environment specially designed for and ideally suited to human habitation. What a wonderful future! Life is at last eternal! Thanks to the revolutionary genetic data analysis equipment developed by the Byflos Group, human DNA data will be able to communicate with future generations even after the death of the physical body. As long as you live in your own city, your lives will never end. So, is this guy... Is he talking about, like, uploading people's consciousness to a computer or encoding encoding their genome into the computer and then they exist digitally because it's it's neural city? What the fuck? So, okay, so Layla, yeah, Layla, the woman I love, uh, is the only thing I care about, the one thing that makes life worth living. So he's going to find a cure for this virus for this one chick and not for the betterment of humankind. What a... Fuck that guy. Okay, hang on. We need... Is there more story? Can I move so we don't have to hear the beep anymore? Can we walk over here? Okay. I'm gonna stand in this corner. I'm standing in this corner. You know what? Just deal with it for a second, okay? History of by okay, 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 check this out. His history. So there, okay, the International Peacekeeping Force, August 16th, 2038. That's how, that's how Kalik's opening thing started. The South Pole Observation Base. Okay. Dr. Kim was prevented from being unleashed and unprecedented international disaster averted at the last moment. So they're talking about the first game. After the death of Byflo's destruction of the South Base, he was succeeded by his eldest son as the fifth leader of the of the Byflo's group. So that's the guy on the TV. Immediately following the incident, an unknown deadly virus, the Jigari virus, spread with unprecedented speed. The death rate was nearly 100% within 10 days after the appearance of symptoms. The virus was not transmitted in, in environments devoid of ultraviolet light. Okay, so it... So the virus can't survive in ultraviolet light. That means it should... Fuck, whatever. Fucking whatever. So, it does it say Dr. Kim? It doesn't say... It's not specifically linking the events of the first game to this one. Because I was trying to see where Dr. Kim played into all this. Where Kalik, whatever, played into all this. So apparently, I think what they're insinuating is that when we defeated Dr. Kim in the first game and we blew the, we blew that, we fucking nuked that place and destroyed it, that in a roundabout way caused the virus to be unleashed that basically wiped out humanity. So really, I guess we should have fucking left Dr. Kim alone. Should have let him do his thing. <laughs> or maybe not just, maybe not nuke the base. That could have also been an option. Uh, is, have we been in... No, we haven't been in this room. This is a blue room. We have another TV to watch. Hang on. What's on channel 3? The Bifrost Group began activities on a global scale at the beginning of the 21st century. My grandfather, William Bifrost, established his corporate headquarters in Chile, 
and went on to build a business empire unrivaled throughout the world. My father, Carl Beifloss, further diversified business lines to include pharmaceuticals, foodstuffs, livestock feed, communications, oil, mining, and heavy industries, and made it one of the world's leading conglomerates. That's it? So is this guy gonna say that his grandfather gave him a small loan of a million dollars or something? Is that what, is that what we're working up toward? Okay. You've been making a lot of noise, buddy. I'm trying to watch TV. Okay, somebody's shooting at me. Oh my god, it's trash can robot. Okay, got Oh, there's a turret. Shit. Okay, I, I, I gotta look up. Why did, why did you keep this mechanic in the game? It's like one of the worst things from Kill League 1. Was, was that, was the looking mechanic. Now, let's, let's try, uh... Let's, let's, let's try out the machine gun on somebody. I mean, I, I guess it works. Is it gonna? Is it gonna tell me? If, okay, this. This is infinitely spawning these guys, isn't it? I blow that guy up, and there's another one coming down from the from the. Oh fuck this! Hang on, are they? Wait, did that guy just blow a hole in the wall? Capabilities. God damn it. No, this was already on the map. What is this? Power decreasing. B A two six one B. Patrol robot equipped with laser. Power decreasing. Okay, so I guess that doesn't work. It's saying that the power's out, so we, we can't watch that TV, which I'm fine with. This... Oh, whoa! Good fucking lord! Okay, so we unlock the keycard door. And this looks like a, where we go to get the map. Oh my god, what the fuck did that, what, what, did, what did that do? Okay, so that was the room we were just in where it said the power was low. So I bet if we go back in there, we can, we can check out what's on dish. Oh god, we gotta watch out for the exploding trash cans though. Okay, yeah, look, the lights are on. Okay. Sex 911. Great. That didn't age well. Equipped 212% better armor. That's. Operation is based on SJ107. The strongest protect armor currently available. You say that, but as soon as one of these trash can assholes bumps into me, they do like half my health bar and damage. Is this open yet? Can I go in here? This is definitely, you can definitely open this. Look, there's a blue spot behind it on the map. You can, you can go in here. Do I lure these guys over? And then, like, quickly. I, fuck, I knew it. I knew it. I, I'm, I'm good. I'm good at bad games. What do y'all got in here? What is? What's this? What do we got in here? 
What is that? I want that. Cartridge acquired. You didn't tell me what that one was, lady. What was that one? Am I supposed to figure that one out? This looks like a bomb. Cartridge acquired. Cartridge acquired. I'm guessing this is all ammunition for, for very... Oh, shit. Oh, shit. That's bad. Source. Can we get a health pack? Can we get can we get one of those? I was, I'm supposed to have 212% better armor, but I feel like I'm getting fucked pretty hard right here. Can I open these? Can I shoot these? No. Okay. We need we need to get away from them. This is bad. This is not good. We don't want, we don't want to be. We don't want to be. Oh, okay. So so those just both of those in, infinitely spawn robots. We need to get the hell out of here. Why would you do that? Why would you make it always spawn? I guess it's because you always have ammo now. That's not how it works! Alright, we have a key card. Can we go in here now? That's a no. So the enemies come out of those air vents constantly. That's all that's taught me. Can I... Okay, I, I'm assuming... I'm assuming I can't kill those. Also, I just noticed that my laser... there You don't have unlimited ammo. Because that meter only charges up to where the back of the background... Wait, does it? I don't know what that means. I, I can't. I don't know what any of this means. I don't understand this game. Oh shit! Fucking trash can robots. So what's the green section do? What, what is this? Is this locked? Blue key card we need a blue key card. We don't, have, we don't have the right. Is that also blue key card? Because it's blue on the door. Locked. Okay, we can't get in there. So, this is another room full of computers and health packs. This is where the robots come to do yoga. This doesn't do anything, right? Okay, this doesn't do anything. Can I shoot? Can I shoot these? Oh, the trash cans can open doors. How? This has definitely got to be the Wee Willy Wiener Warper. This is it. Yep, yep, how do I use it? <laughs> it's not doing anything. Does it? Is it gonna crush me if I. No, you can't get over here. So, does it refill the meter on the right? Or. Because I'm, I'm, I'm looking at the laser thing on the left. And I wanna know how to, how to fill that back up. I guess not, but unfortunately, I hate to say it, you guys, the, 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 the Wee Willy Wiener Warper, it does make a return. It does make a return, but it does not have its own dedicated cutscene for using it anymore. It's just, whoop, okay, you've seen it, there you go. Oh, there's a guy over there. That looks like a turret. Hang on. Accessing analysis mode. Ow! Analysis well, he hit me from downtown. Looks like a battle bot. It's like a shitty battle bot is what that looks like. Serpentine, 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 serpentine. Just that simple. Take that bite force. Right, so what's back here? Cartridge acquired. Key card okay, so acquired. that's our blue key card, so we can go back to... I already forgot where it was. We'll get back there eventually. Unlocked. Have we not been in here? I mean, I, that's a stupid question. I guess we haven't, otherwise the game wouldn't have said unlocked. Okay. Okay. What do you got here? 
Oh no, it's astrological signs. It's a puzzle. Oh, we haven't gotten no hints for this. What's... That's like a mini disc player back there. I want that. Shit, we haven't. I we've received no hints as to what any. Have we? I don't even. I don't even know. I don't even know. What's in here? Have we been in here? No, we haven't been. I would remember. I would remember that blue. Str I see. I see that. I see the trash can robot. It says no attack capabilities, but as soon as it touches you, it blows up and you die. These aren't doors. These are nothing. Okay, those, those are maps of the levels. Oh, that looks like something. Hang on. Bullets. Maybe those four doors near the elevator had symbols. On the door. What is this? Oh no, it's this again. Bringing back lots of the good stuff from Kalik, I see. Oh shit. Well, this is just three. Hang on. We turn them all one color, right? Okay, that made a click. That did something. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh. oh. Okay, I, I have an idea. The, the 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 colored lights, the colored the 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 things. I bet they open. The I I I, I bet they open those doors. There was a red one somewhere though, right? There was, here it is. This is what I was looking for. Okay. Wait, did that? Yeah, so this door was just open now. So what's back here? Oh! Hey, look at that! It's a thing. That's what we need. <laughs> it actually has the symbols on it. So if I hang on, can I open, check out my ma my maps and items and get yeah, code card? So how do we use that? Does it like we hold it and that one's the this one? I don't know what all those are. So I bet if we turn all these to blue, it'll open those blue doors. Yes, I heard another click. It's a TV room. After all that, okay, well, let's South Base instead of South Park. That's what we got. Mission Research Facility built at the South Pole by the Bryfrost Group in 2030. It soon assumed a pivotal role in Bryfrost operations, originally functioning as a mining base for underground reservoirs of natural resources. Bryfrost also took advantage of its strategic location to conduct a broad spectrum of research, including environmental experimentation concerning the destruction of the ozone layer. In 2038, the South Base was destroyed by members of the International Wait, that's me. Peacekeeping Force. We did that! That was Kalik 1! You're talking about me. That was us. We, we went in there and we blew up Dr. Kim. Spoiler alert, he turned into a big spider stuck on the wall. Okay, we got we got another TV to watch. Del Sol, the fanatical group of criminals, has risen in opposition to the Bifloss group. This rebel alliance seeks to sabotage our great work in progress with their campaign of destruction and terror. The Bifloss group offers a cash reward for information leading to the capture and arrest of leader Carlos Petrero and all active Del Sol soldiers who threaten the peace and happiness of all. Wait, did he, did he say, did he say Carlos was the leader of the resistance? Talk about my boy Carlos from Kill League One, he's still around? Okay, this is where we got the key card. We've gone too far. Where were, we gotta go to the room with the 
the astrological symbols. I don't I don't know where it was. I'm lost. All these rooms look the same. Can you fault me? But here we go. Okay. So, but now So it was that one, that one. Like Gemini. And then the one that looks like a letter M. Right? So we need. What do you mean? Lock. Son of a bitch. Okay, so we if we come in here and we're looking at it like, okay. Now we pull up the thing, right? Now we look at the thing. We got the one that looks like a whip, and then the, the Roman numeral 2, and then Gemini, and then the one that looks like an M. Actually, I think Gemini is the one that looks like a Roman numeral 2. I don't know what the other one is. Fuck it. 69. Nice. So, we got the whip, we got the Nene, we got the 69. This is correct. You son of a bitch. Dr. Kim. Locked. Okay, well let's let's do it this way then. Let's do it this way. That one. And we'll put Gemini on this one. Locked. Pisces. I don't know which one is Pisces. Okay, so what if... Okay, so hear me out. Are they gonna make us do every... It can't be this hard. It can't be this fucking hard. Something's wrong. Can I select... I can't select any of these items. It's like the inverse of Galeek 1's maps, where it was just very long, narrow hallways. It was kind of easy to figure out where you were. I can't believe I'm saying I miss Kalik One's maps, but I do. So I was thinking maybe maybe I got this wrong and the code card has those symbols on it and it's like a floppy disk that we put into a computer somewhere and then the computer tells us here's what you gotta do. I can't I can't even read this map. You guys, we're gonna be here forever. This stream will never end. We haven't even beaten the first stage. Does green do anything? Okay, well it made a click. those trash can guys just keep coming out maybe maybe it opens this because this is all green walls and the we can go to the main gate no why is everything in here green I'm afraid to go down the elevator because I don't I'm afraid it's gonna end the stage right and if this is anything like kill Leap one if you miss anything in a stage you cannot go back to get it and if it's anything and it is if this is anything like kill Leap one if you miss anything, you're fucked up. Hang on, let me see something. Yes, that does just refill the middle bar for my boost meter. That's what that is. That's what, that's what the PP meter. That's what the PP machine does. We figured that. That's one. That's one myth busted. Of course, no attack so capabilities. Oh no. You can go back. You can go back to the floor before. Holy shit. Maybe, you know what? Maybe the other elevator takes us here. Or over there, I mean, whatever. You guys get it. Y'all are smart. 
Okay, yeah, so this took us to the other side of this thing that we haven't been to yet. And here's the... Oh, fuck, fuck. God damn it. Okay, well, it's a good thing we put all those colors on green, because this is actually what we needed to do the whole time. Okay, we got more TVs. Maybe, maybe one of these will give us the thing. History. As a result of the agricultural and industrial revolutions, the Earth's population grew to unprecedented numbers. At the same time, however, they were also responsible for the destruction of Earth's environment. Kalik worked to influence the development of the human race, but they continued to evolve in a direction different from Kalik's ideal life form. Okay, so that, that recaps the first game, talking about how Dr. Kim was some mad scientist who was like, uh, the Kalik strain of DNA that was like, in this, buried in the ice in the South Pole. Basically the thing, kind of, in a, in a sense. He was going to enhance human DNA and that's kind of what they're talking about. I guess some more, more TVs. A lot of empty rooms that only have TVs. Well, I guess I don't have to shoot those guys. They tend not to attack me unless I attack them. They're like bees. ID Air. Discovery of unauthorized entry into government database. Uh oh. Oh! Whoa! Oh! What do you got? What is this? Oh! You are fucking kidding me! Get me out of here! Yeah, I'll say. Hey, thanks for checking out Gatorbox on YouTube. We really appreciate it. If you like what you saw and you want to kick around with us live, follow us on Twitch because we do this several times during the week. And if you want to support this channel, you can do so by subscribing right here on YouTube, following or subscribing over on Twitch, or even making a pledge on Patreon. Your support over the years has been tremendous. Thank you so, so much. And we look forward to seeing you in the next video right here on Gatorbox.